With a December 11 government shutdown looming, lawmakers have reached a deal on the overall totals for a $1.4 trillion federal budget, Politico reported Monday evening, but they'll only have two weeks to finalize the bill before the deadline and it's too early to tell whether any additional coronavirus relief will be included in that legislation. We have been working on the omnibus bill, and I thought that would be a segue into more coronavirus relief. House Speaker Nancy Pelosi D. Califf, said during a press briefing last Friday. Let's hope that it is, 15 days. That's how long lawmakers have before the December 11 shutdown deadline. If the deadline comes and goes before Congress passes a spending bill, federal agencies will be forced to shut down some of their discretionary functions excluding essential services until new funding legislation is enacted, according to the Committee for a Responsible Federal Budget. That could affect federal retirement benefits from the Social Security Administration, Medicare benefits, IRS mortgage and loan approvals, air travel, national parks, and more, the CRFP said. Appropriators strike deal on funding totals to avoid December shutdown Politico spending deal by December 11 hinges on Thanksgiving allocation pact, roll call, Pelosi and McConnell want an omnibus spending bill to avert government shutdown, White House Chief of Staff says he, can't guarantee, it will happen, Forbes Senate Republicans release $1.4 trillion spending plan, without COVID-19 relief, ahead of December 11th government shutdown deadline Forbes.